Mabuhay! Great day guys! Welcome to TSA Toy Stash in Action with another toy review and I'm Ranger Dave and today we are gonna check out the McFarlane Toys DC Multiverse Penguin figure. Now this is based on the Batman Arkham City and yes this is another part for the collect to build Solomon Grundy Wave. So yes, without further ado guys, let's go ahead and check this figure out. Alright guys, so here is Penguin inside of the packaging looking really really dope. Now before anything else guys, a big shout out to Wildcard Collections on helping us out to get this figure for review. Really really awesome guy. So look at this guys, it looks so good, I love it. Alright, and of course here is the back of the packaging, you got Solomon Grundy and it says here he has the head and the what do you call this like the jacket or suit kind of thing uh, that Solomon Grundy has but yeah uh, looking really really dope so let's go ahead and open this figure up alright guys so here he is guys outside of the packaging we got Mr. Cobblepot himself the penguin looking at the detail of this figure is amazing guys a lot of texturing is going on obviously now articulation wise this is you know it, it's okay you know it'll do what the penguin does you know obviously the the entire build of the body or penguin he's just like a mob boss so i don't really mind uh, you know a few you know articulation mishaps on that but you know this figure looks really really great so let's get to it and check this figure out all right so here it is guys so the head sculpt looks amazing i love that entire look though right here it feels like there's like a coin inside instead of a patch but yeah whatever it is i haven't seen you know the arkham city but it looks really really dope i love it it's really really nasty you have that age kind of look to penguin that he, you know he's been doing this for a long time now and yeah it looks really really dope i love the texturing right here when it comes to the entire you know leather suit and then of course the fur looks amazing the paint job looks really really alive then you got this you know inner suit right there the layer suit looks really really dope as well so i do have a little paint mishap on that you know really really small but other than that it looks really, really nice and then if you look at it right there at the other side that's like a metal piece i don't know what it is but it is sculpted in there and i feel like it's something like you know like an injury or like a patch to a penguin it looks really really dope and then of course you got uh, you know right here the bandage hand and then of course a gripping hand and then of course you got the boots Looking really really nice overall guys. This figure looks really really amazing. I mean look at the texture on that It's just really good and going to the accessory guys. You got the penguin card and of course a you know uh, stand right there for McFarlane toys and yes of course you do have the Solomon Grundy head and of course uh, the jacket that comes with it. really really nice and yes the piece of resistance we got you know the cobble pot uh, what do you call this umbra <laughs> slash you know Swiss army knife weapon gun shield whatever you want to do with this umbrella it could do it now going to the articulation for this figure this figure has a lot of articulation for a penguin figure so you got a side to side motion right there up and down and you can tilt a little so it adds more emotion to it you got a 360 rotation right here for the arms and then you can raise it up about this much you got a bicycle right there and then of course double jointed elbows really really dope and then of course you got a super right here at the wrist it does have a hinge at the wrist upper diaphragm torso um yeah actually it just goes at the waist that you can move it side to side up and down and you know just push press it that much of a crunch so that's really good and then again right here you can make him do the splits all right yes the penguin can do the splits about that far down forward about this much and then back about this much and then a single joint right here at the knees it can swivel at the knee down right there and then you got a boot cut right here swivels at the boots as well all right swivels at the boots as well you got that boot cut right there really really nicely so yeah basically that's it for the articulation of the penguin so it has a lot of articulation and just for fun guys here is our mr cobble pot penguin himself next with Rachel Gould and of course catwoman so you got a little bit of a you know um 
rogues gallery for Batman, which is really, really dope. dope. And lastly, guys, here is our, you know, penguin figure next with the three jokers Batman again. And yes, we did bring in the Platinum Edition Batfleck McFarlane figure. Now, this one has a custom cape, guys. So, if you want to see the video how we did that, you can check out the link right here up there. All right, it's up there. But yeah, I really love how this penguin looks right here. You can fit it on your comic version. You can fit it on your you know, cinematic version. I mean, the look of it, it's just really, really insane. I love it. All right, guys, so that's my take for the McFarlane Toys DC Multiverse Penguin figure, you know, by the Batman Arkham City uh, line. And yes, this is the uh, Solomon Grundy way. Overall, guys, I love the entire figure. The only complaint that I have is right here on that you know umbrella i wish that it does more stuff or it opens up but yeah i'm totally happy about this figure totally giving it a 5 out of 5 rating and i hope you guys like this video and if you are new to the channel please do hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell to be updated on every new video we have here we have hundreds of videos on the channel for you guys to check out and if you find one that you like or nah we're just happy you're here remember guys life is just one big collection peace out god bless Look at that penguin!